I gave my life to the Lord back in um, February of 1970. And um, I could never in those days look this far into the future. You know, I thought I'd be, you know, totally the Jetsons by now. You know, just traveling in space in our own little jet mobile. But here we are, you know, and uh, some parts of the world look, they ha look like they haven't changed in 2,000 years, like the Middle East. Um, seems like America's changing, but I think at the heart of America, there is there's, uh, something God has deposited in the heart of America that I believe is sincere and wants to know the Lord, the God of truth. And I'm believing, like Francis Frangipane, an author, I've read some of his books, and he says, God's not done with America yet, just like God's not done with Israel yet. And bless those who bless Israel. And I just believe that amazing times are ahead because, well, because that's the way God planned it. You know, the world's in uproar and there's wars and rumors of wars and a lot of uncertainty economically, but we can put our trust in the Lord. Some, some trust in horses, some trust in chariots, some trust in careers, some trust in uh, talent, some trust in prestige and influence, but we will remember the name of the Lord our God, Jesus Christ, and uh, be true believers in Him, believe His Word, and we will hang together like, you know, like we're supposed to. So this is called True Believers. Thanks for listening to my music. And a one, and a two. <laughs> Where we mean to stay 
Love is alive. 